to find range intercut down range for group data. First, let's find range. To find range, we use the highest class data, which is you have to use the midpoint. So 99 plus 90 divided 2 minus the smallest range data, which is this. So use the midpoint as well, plus it together and divide 2. And this will give you 94.5 minus 54.5 and equal to 40. So the range is a 40. So to find interquartile range, you need to use Q3 minus Q1. So the formula is exactly the same as your median. Your median formula here is your lower boundary plus and divide 2 minus big F over small f times plus. In this case, to find Q3, you first you need to find the range. Let me use the other color. Okay, Q3 means 3 over 4 of your n. So 3 over 4 of your n means 3 over 4 times 60. It will give you a 45. And for Q1, it will be 1 over 4 times n, which means 1 over 4 times 60, which will give you a 15. So let's look at the cumulative frequency. Your Q1 will be at this part as 15 is in the 38. And for your Q3, it will be in this part as 45 is in your 54. So focus in these two groups. First, to find Q3, simply apply the formula. So Q3, the lower body over here is 79.5 plus your n over 2 now change to your 304 n, which is 45, minus your big F. Big F is your cumulative data frequency of previous data, of this previous class, which is 38, minus the frequency of the Q3, which is 16, times the class, which is 10, and then minus your Q1. So same, open a big bracket, your Q1 over body is 69.5 plus now your median is n over 2 but your Q1 is 1 over 4n which is 15. So apply 15 minus the cumulative frequency of previous class which is 14 divide the, the frequency of your class is Q1 which is 24 times the class okay in this case you have to get your calculator to do the work and in this part it will be 83.875 minus 69.987 so in this case your interquartile range will be 13.958